Anne undresses. I take her clothes and hand her a night dress. Oh, had a good breakfast. <clears throat> Bread and dripping. We a big pot of tea. Sets you up for the day. Not what you'll be used to, mind. Devilled kidneys in a silver dish. A china or Indian model. Not eaten. Well, that'd be hard, but need copy. Oh, can I do that? Are you listening? I'm talking to you. You'll have the manners to pay attention. You're not at home with your servants here. In here, I am one of your betters. Free to come and go as I please. No doctor putting his hairy hands on me. Ah, you don't like that, do you? I've seen you. Shutting your eyes, waiting for it all to be over. You think the examination was worse than the feeding? Well, they're not all at you. <laughs> Some of your pals are more than happy to have the doctor rummaging in their goonies. You attend them too. Arabella, how is she? Well, you think I'm going to be your spy? Your postman? Carrying messages between the fine ladies, and then you'll get me into trouble with the doctor. I just want to know if she's all right. Oh, she's all right. She and the doctor get along famously. Well, she doesn't mind his hairy hands. Are you jealous? One of your special friends fraternising with the enemy. <laughs> Sororising. What? Uh, Fraternising is from frater, the Latin for brother. Soror is Latin for sister, and really it should be sororizing. Oh, pardon my ignorance. Well, I wasn't correcting you. Are you there? Eh? Well, I may not speak Latin, but I can smell stinking fish. Uh, you don't recognize me, do you? Well, have we met before? Have we met before? Well, not socially, you might say. We weren't introduced. I mean, not low Latin, but I know you, Miss Parker. Oh, hi. You're paying attention to me now. Do your superiors know my name? Do your superiors know my name? Oh, not yet. What shall I tell them? Oh, well, that depends. And don't you want to know what that depends on? Still not recognise me? Oh, you've hurt my feelings. I thought I'd made a wee bit of impression. Well, go on, I guess. It's not hard. In another prison. Dundee. <laughs> you have no idea, <coughs> have you? You just looked right through me. Craig Inches. My darling fan, I haven't slept a wink since hearing. And when I think of your dear curls lying on the grimy mat, You were the one she trusted with her letters. I was the one she bribed, but she didn't pay me enough to carry that film. So you destroyed them? Oh, no. I kept them safe. Well, you never know when they might come in useful. Are you asking me for money? I might be. Or I might be asking you for something else. What do you think it's worth keeping your dirty little secret? Well, expecting someone, are you? The doctor. Oh, so didn't I tell you? Oh, no, doctor won't be coming this morning. He gave me the job of feeding you. Are you medically qualified? I can tell one hopefully another. <laughs> Turn over, prisoner Arthur. She doesn't move. I'll lift her by the hair and drop her. Why do you want to hurt me? Because you won't behave. 